Standing behind me now is the uh, new Sydney fish markets, which once finished will be a fantastic uh, attraction for Sydney. You've got an iconic building and project being constructed by Australian companies, you know, all collaborating together to get the job done. It, it is pretty rewarding. Installing and building the tower cranes in, in Black Bottle Bay comes with its challenges. Naturally, there's, there's water here, but there is a lot more complexity into the planning and, and engineering stages of it. We essentially designed the support system for the, uh, to support our tower crane, so a little bit different to a typical project. We did install these prior to closure of our cofferdam, so they were exposed to tidal waters, so we did have to factor in some tidal loading and marine action. We installed our main building piles. Uh, we installed bracing, which provided lateral support for our, our village connection, and essentially that bracing we used divers to install, so they rigged underwater and grouted those in place. When we were designing the support system, we had to make sure that we didn't have any penetrations in our hydrostatic structure. That saw us using structural steel plunge columns to support our grillage, and those columns are actually going to be used for the main build. And then we installed our tower crane on top from that. The task of the cranes really is to lift all the building material into the project. So they'll be lifting weights on this project anywhere from less than a tonne um, up to 100 tonnes unique to this project to be able to be lifting off the water, something you don't do every day. There's been so many people involved, uh, a lot of the local guys, everything from fabricators to welders, barge crews, crane operators. Multiplex, SMC and Mars uh, were definitely a good team together. Putting the tower cranes up went really seamlessly, so everyone's planning from, from all different sides really come together nicely. Multiplex are always looking at better ways to be more sustainable. The cranes will be utilising HBO 100 renewable diesel. It's a zero emissions fuel. There's up to a 90% reduction in overall emissions. It's something that the industry needs to adopt and Multiplex are doing it. It's fantastic. Yeah, definitely there's a sense of pride for SMC completing these works, seeing them up there and, and everything working as planned. It's really exciting to be part of this project. Uh, you know, it's a, a fantastic, iconic piece of infrastructure that the New South Wales government has invested in. You know, it's something I'm going to look back on in, in, for many years and be really proud of what we've done here. To see something you spent hours planning and then to see it come to fruition, it's, it's quite exciting and it's extremely rewarding. Now that we've got these three tower cranes installed, it allows the next phase of this project to take shape. <laughs>